Welcome to WP Math once again. Here in this video, we are going to look at the header sticky effect. As an example, when I scroll down in this page, the header does not become sticky. But Elements Kit provides you the features using that you can make any part of your website sticky. So let's see how you can work with it. Go to your dashboard, Elements Kit, Header Footer. Click Edit with Elementor. Now in the website, we want to make the entire header sticky. And the entire header is under the section. So click on the section, then go to advanced and there you'll find elements kit is sticky. Open it and there is the sticky setting. Now if you click on the drop down, you'll find none. Right now it is none. Then top, bottom, column and show on a scroll up. In this video, we're going to talk about the top feature. Now when you select the top, you'll find some other option like a sticky until, a sticky offset, background color and so on. When you select top, the header part is already becoming sticky. Now click update, then go to your front page and the header part is not sticky now. After you refresh the page and you scroll down, you can see the header part is sticky now. But you can see the problem is that this part is sticky but it's transparent. So you might need to add a background color when the part is sticky. In order to do this, Go to your dashboard, then there you'll find an option which is a sticky background color. From here, we can select a color. We're going to select the background color is white. Then again, click on update and go to the font page, then refresh the page. After refreshing the page, if you scroll down, there you can see the header background color is white. If you want to keep your header part until the about part comes at top, you can also do it. In order to do it, we have to create an ID to this about section. Now let's do it. Click on edit with Elementor, then go to the about part and click on the section. Click advanced and there you'll find the option to create an ID. I'm giving the ID name ekit underscore sticky underscore end all right then save the page now go to the dashboard and there you will find an option which is a sticky until in this box you have to use the same id you don't have to push any hash before the id now save the page and from the front page, click on the review button. Now after refreshing the page, when I scroll down, you can see the header becomes sticky, but when the about part comes, the header is no more sticky. And another thing that I want to talk about in this video is that you might face an issue when you use transparent header. In my case, I'm not using any transparent header. The header background is completely white. And when I scroll down, the background color becomes white. So that's the reason I'm not facing any problem. Uh, let me show you what I'm talking about here if you're not clear. So in here, you can see I have used the background color is white. What if I use the background color a little bit gray and save it. Now again, I'm coming back to the front page and refreshing the page. I'm in the top, I'm not scrolling down, but the background color is still gray. But when you use a transparent header, when you're not scrolling down, you don't need any background color for the header. You might need the background color when you scroll down. So in here, the elements kit provides you another option. Let me show you what it is. It is a class adding feature. When you scroll down a bit, for example, uh, when I scroll to 50 pixel, a new class will be added to the element, which is a kit sticky effects. So using this class, you can make any CSS you want. In my example, I have used the class which is ekit sticky effects and I made the background color is a little bit gray and to use it I'm going to remove the background color from here because what I want is that when I will scroll down to 50 pixel a background color will be added through this class click on the update and now go to the font page and refresh the page and there you can see this header part is still transparent but when I scroll down to 50 pixel my background color is being applied now. Thank you so much for watching this video.